Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am truly zonked and I need to fix my toilet. The freaking bar inside the tank on the handle rusted away and broke. <laughs> and so I gotta get a new uh, handle installed on that, but that's my problem. So anyways, welcome back to my playthrough of The Shore, a uh, Lovecraftian horror story uh, game that has apparently thrown my save out. Um, yeah, and I'm a little annoyed about that. Uh, I hope this doesn't happen again. Uh, and I did test and, and verify. Yep. Um, there's no, there's no file. I mean, I found the save folder. There's a bunch of save files, but they seem to be linked to specific events in the game. Okay. So what I need to do very quickly, well... It'll be quicker for you, you for that for you than it is for me. Is I am going to run through these objects quickly, as quickly as it'll let me, and it get back to the point where we were yesterday. So give me a few minutes. Well, again, it'll be a few minutes for me, and less for you. Okay, as I'm retracing my steps here, I did find one thing. Oh. Huh. Yeah, we didn't find that the first time through. So I thought I'd just show you that, I guess. <laughs> All right, let me continue catching up to where I was before. Okay, this is slightly peculiar um when i visited the section of the game where you spin these four discs and the obelisk gets up and starts walking away mine is stalled this time last time that thing just kept right on walking towards some corner of the island and uh Mine has not for some reason. Let me see something. Before I continue, let me go back to that area with the four discs. Hold that thought. Alright, so... Yeah, I don't know which is the correct behavior, so I'm back out to where we unlocked that thing to begin with. It appears to have walked that far and stopped. In the previous playthrough, that thing just kept right on walking, so I don't know... Was it supposed to stop where it is now, or is it supposed to just keep right on walking? Hmm... We shall see... Okay, so we're about caught up. I visited all the spots, and uh... Place that stone. Oh yeah, we have to take this cosmic looking stone. Very pretty. again okay so previous episode we went through here and we met our demise this is a one-way portal and oh those are kind of creepy they're not quite octopuses are they the beasts with a thousand mouths? Well, there's a bunch of them. Can't step on them. So yeah, we saw that great, great big guy. We'll name him Cuddles. 
<laughs> All right, now before we go around behind that beached whale there, I just want to see what else is around this side, around the outside, around the outside. Nothing over here. Okay. So, now what I want to see... Is can I take one of these harpoons? Oh god, that startled me again. I forgot that was coming. <laughs> I can't take the harpoons. There's a seagull inside the whale. All right. So now there's a fish creature munching on the side of that whale, and he is what killed us last time. So I'm going to see if I can steer clear of him this time. So we, nope. Come on. Run. Where am I going? I guess I'm going in here. Uh, he's probably right on my ass. I don't want to stop. I don't want to stop. I've got no weapons. I've got no way to fight. All the threatening sounds stopped. I guess that really is the only thing you can do. <laughs> oh, it caved in. Oh. Trapped me inside here. Boy, I hope there wasn't supposed to be something on the other side I was supposed to find, but I don't think I would have gotten a chance, really. Okay. Its asymmetrical shape is unknown to me. I wouldn't risk taking this with me, and I don't want to know what happened to these guys either. Let me, uh, I gotta turn this music down a little bit. I do like the music, but it's a bit powerful. There's Cuddles. My crew and I took refuge in the tunnel. We can't remember how we ended up here. There is only a small glimpse of a vast dark memory that is accompanied by a whisper. What matters most is staying alive. We are few in number, but it matters not. Once there was a Greek warrior named Leonidas. He and 300 of his men held off an army of one million. Diver suit. Oh, am I wearing it now? Can I walk in the water now? Make sure. This is probably telling me, yeah, there's nowhere else to go on this side. Okay, we're going in the water. With the fish people. Now, the thing is... Now, through the depths, you will find your destiny. This is like a, uh, a bell jar diving suit. Um... Who is supplying me with air? <laughs> so it's just some coral. I 
We don't have an air meter. Nothing seemingly you can do with the, uh, the trickles of air bubbles. And this is a crashed submarine. Appears to be. Can't go inside. All right. What happened? That was weird. I got stuck or something for a moment. I saw you. So swim around behind that rock. And of course, I am the kind of fool who will walk toward it. <laughs> Probably can't get too far in here. Nope. What is that? Hello. We'll call him Wiggles. <laughs> okay, this appears to be our destination. Oh, some kind of puzzle. Okay. Let's take a look at this. What have we got going on here? What are we trying to form? I'm guessing these rotate... Yeah. Into some... Alright. Something clicked. Is that not quite it yet? Alright, so the both of those have made a click now. I still can't seem to do anything with it though. I can't interact with that one anymore can't interact with this one anymore. Something open somewhere else? Let's take a look at this again. No, that's just kind of floating in place. Can't go around it. Oh, there's another one behind me. 
Because I'm blind. Alright. Okay. Shadow and I came to a curious sort of an agreement. My lack of empathy has phased out any trace of fear. How did my monotonous self come closer and closer to the fact that nothing surprises me anymore? Have I lost my humanity? Not lost. But discovering its new potential. How far would you go, aren't you? How far would you go? Forever. I would fall into the darkest pit to save her. So be it. Okay. Um. Well, we are not given any way to defend ourselves, at least so far in this game. So... Little to do but walk toward <laughs> the giant tentacles. Music is only slightly threatening. I got a feeling I know what we're supposed to do, but I want to look around first if I can. Oh, there's more than one? Oh. Beast with a thousand mouths? Tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> yep. Um. Well, if this is the wrong thing to do, we're going to find out. Okay. Moving here. Oh, shit. <sighs> Couldn't move fast enough. All right, where's it going to respawn us? All right, we're still underwater. We're still in the diving suit. Back before this puzzle. Okay. There's no sprinting underwater here. Oh, hello. Nothing that appears to be a weapon that I can use. Oh. There goes a fish person. Can't follow him, though. Alright. Let's try this again. Where am I going? Alright, let me stick to the left. Just gotta keep moving here. I don't even wanna look behind me. Alright, I don't know where I'm going. Oh, there's something. And that's not creepy at all. Crap, there's the other thing. Ah! What am I doing?
Oh. I have to turn around. <laughs> I'm sitting here waiting for something to happen. It's because I'm facing the blackness. And... All right, where am I? Oh. Look behind you. This blood plasmic abomination will consume everything in its way. Hurry, find the artifact. It is in a safe place. Shit! What the hell is that? Oh crap. There's all kinds of things in here. Where am I going? I'm just running right now. Shit. Where am I going? Um. Hello, oh, shit. Shit! I'm dead. Oh, I had an option to fight back. I didn't even notice it. Crap! Alright. Okay, let's do that again. Look behind you. The protoplasmic abomination. Protoplasmic abomination will consume everything in its way. Hurry, find the artifact. It is in the same of a child. Okay, yeah, that's big and scary. Alright, I'm running around these guys for now. Hello, how are you? Um, don't know where I'm going still. Okay, I, I, I really am. I'm just running wherever it will let me go and trust in the corral. Okay, that. Uh, go, 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 go. You look like somewhere to be. Oh shit, it's on my side. Oh shit, it's on the other side. Crap. Oh god, move, move, move. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Come on. Alright, I don't know where I'm going. I really don't. <laughs> I'm just going wherever it'll let me go. Which isn't far. Shit, it's on top of me. Didn't I have options to fight back before? I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Back to the TARDIS. So, can I make a better plan this time? Huh. Okay, I will bear out to the right this time. See. Okay, that purple star before is where we went towards this that last go. There's something up here. All right. So let's um, place the thing. Look behind you. This protoplasmic abomination will consume everything in its way. Alright. Hurry. Find the artifact. It is in the same of a triangle. Me already. God damn it. I'm stuck. Ah. Look behind you. This protoplasmic abomination will consume everything in its way. Hurry. Find the artifact. It is in the shape of a child. Alright, 
trying to head towards the only thing that looks like an obvious path. Oh, that's big. That's big. Hello, how are you? Pardon me. Just visiting. Is this the artifact? I know you from Skyrim. <laughs> um. Walk the path of the void, but all right, let's see if there's another path here. Doesn't look it. So, yeah, I can't follow off there. Okay, let's go back up here. Now, which way from here, though? Why did he give me the artifact or direct me to it if it was just going to fail me at some point? Hermaeus Mora. I needed to look it up. It was killing me. I couldn't recall the Daedra's name. Oh, okay. What do I got here? Nothing I can interact with. What is up with my arm? That's interesting. The artifact you are holding has the essence of the gatekeeper. Use it wisely and tread carefully around you. For I need some time before I pull you out. Use it wisely. Does that mean it's going to run out? <laughs> okay, there's a big nasty something.
reappearing. Kill them enough time to stop. Can't seem to get the jam down. Oh, where did it send me? Okay, at least it didn't send me all the way back to the beginning. Alright, so... What happens if I just basically just run? Ah, shit, there's another. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, um... Let's try this again here. So slow. I'm just going back. <sighs> Alright. I'm keeping to the left. I'm just going to hustle as fast as I can possibly manage. Keeping to the left. Run, 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 run. Oh, oh, oh. Shit, 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 shit. I'm dead. I'm gonna go down again. <coughs> Alright. There's two of these things. They don't die. They kind of pop and then immediately reappear. Um... I can't outrun them. I can't outfight them. Alright, let's try... Keeping to the right this time. And see if I can get past this first one that appears. They gave you some time between these things spawning. See, it just comes right back. Now I'm between the two of them. Right into the other one, aren't I? Shit. 
Shit. Shit. Okay, you know something, folks? <laughs> I can only take enough self-abuse for a given moment here. Uh, I think I'm going to have to look up a hint for this. Um, don't hate me for it. <laughs> Alright, I want to thank you for joining me. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this this futile episode. <laughs> it wasn't completely futile, but uh, yeah, it's definitely something. So, um, please like and subscribe. Let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, stay healthy out there, and stay care.